And Midland Genetics and Sylvester Ranch actually started back in 1940 with my great grandpa Wesley Sylvester, who was an an entrepreneur and pioneer of his time in the seed industry, working with cleaning different seeds and also with treatment, which was definitely not uh, the industry standard at the time. Yes, my father, Wes Sylvester, I can remember as a child, spending time in what was our seed house then, which uh, can remember kind of the sights and smells of it, the uh, piles of new burlap bags at that time, which were uh, at least two bushel bags, so they weighed over 100 pounds when they were full. In those days, uh, most of the sales were just to neighbors, that kind of thing. Well, he was still a full-time farmer also, and, and always was, and uh, would work from sunup till sundown, pretty much. He always uh, enjoyed the seed business, I think, and, and took a lot of pride in it. Well, some of my earliest memories in the, the seed business was with my grandfather, Wes, in probably grade school. It's a family feel here, and there are lots of family members here, but they also include the rest of us that aren't of that family to make us feel as if we are. Working with uh, Midland Genetics as a family-owned company is, is more of being a partner with the company than being a number. Your input is, is valued and, and really expected to be a part of the company and, and uh, give your opinion on what you think you can make it better with. Everybody feels welcome to be open and share their opinions and their thoughts. We're a family business, so we like to keep that family spirit going with our employees, and we like to treat everybody like their family. Midland Genetics offers proven to perform. What that means is we do our homework with the testing that we do. We pull data from over 150 locations and really prove the performance of our genetics before they're released. We want to make sure that the customer has a good experience when he opens that bag. And we want to make sure that that seed is uniform and that seed is going to maximize his, his return on his investment. Well, when it's a family business, I think its success or failure is much more important because that's the family's livelihood. I think in the future, I'm, I'm most looking forward to the growth, but being able to be a part of it, like my uncle and my grandpa and my dad were, you know, my brother will be too. And, just kind of you know keeping it growing and you know, the farm side as well as the seed side, I mean, both of them growing together and kind of feeding off of each other. And families like working with families, especially when there's a trust element involved and a transparent element involved. We all understand each other when it comes to those kind of situations with tradition. So in my past experiences with, with my former job, I worked with the larger name brands and today working for a regional company, as Midland Genetics is, uh, enjoy it much better. It's more of a family-oriented business, a lot more flexibility. Basically, uh, being a DSM for Midland Genetics is like owning your own company. They pretty much let me do my thing with a lot of support, and I really appreciate that, and uh, it really works well then that I can take care of my customers with the same format. I think part of our, our success as a, as a family and a business over those four generations has been carrying on that the, the same values I and mean, that same entrepreneur spirit. And although there's been changes in, in the science and the technology in this industry and also the mass production in this industry, I still think if we can, we can hold on to those values and the virtues that we started with, that that will make us competitive and sustainable going forward.